friends, welcome to Best Up TV. I'm Alex. Today I want to introduce to you our new crafted press. And um, it's a must have for you if you want to start a new sublimation printing and the vinyl transfer DIY home business, or if you have a very small workroom, or if you are looking for some small and portable sublimation heat presses. Our new press comes in this very cute baby pink color and this compact size. It only weighs about 35 pounds and uh, very easy to carry it around. You can just put it in your car and take it to a trade fair for some on-site customization or you can take it to your friend's house so you guys can make some DIY items together or you can just place it at home or in your workshop. This cute pink color will add some brightness. And it only takes up a little desktop space, so if you have a small workroom, that's okay. This compact craft press can totally fit in. And uh, although it's compact in size, it can offer a large working area of 23 by 30 centimeters along to fully print out an A4 size design and uh, which is so perfect for printing a t-shirt, a tote bag and a pillow cover or printing some um, printing several small items together such as some keychains, some um, coasters and some hanging ornaments. And it has this very very sturdy baseboard with a silicon mat. It can hold all the items I just mentioned and the stand below is adjustable It can make the machine stand firmly on your desk And our craft press comes with this clamshell piece pattern It can hit evenly and uh, it can be closed and open up with this easy grip handle and uh, on the top of the heat pattern is the pressure knob turning clockwise to increase the pressure and uh, anti-clockwise to decrease the pressure and uh, here is the control panel with a display screen you can set printing time and the temperature here to print different products you want to print so next, let's see how to do the settings. It's very easy to set the parameters. First, turn on the machine and the switch is on the back. Now the screen is on and you can see four buttons on the control panel. Set button, minus and plus buttons and the clear button. Press set button once and press plus and minus buttons to adjust the temperature then press set button again then press plus and uh, minus button to adjust the time then press set button one more time to save all the settings and this machine can remember how many times you have used it you can see the number of use under the time and if you have a large amount of products to print, you can press the clear button for about 8 seconds to reset the counter. Then do the mass printing so the machine can count how many items you have printed. Now we know how to use it, let's print some items. First, put a piece of protective paper to prevent the inks from going onto the silicon mat. Last, put another piece of protective paper on the top so the inks will not stick on the heat pattern.
how to put a piece of silicon paper on the top to prevent the fabric from sticking on the heat pattern. Before printing, peel off the protective film on the aluminum insert. sequence to the right side and the peel of the back film and then place it on the t-shirt I'm going to print the sequence adhesive and fix it on the t-shirt at the same time all the sequence over when they are still hot. This little craft press can print, and uh, with so many printable items and so many customization possibilities, do you guys want to get this amazing craft heat press? Send the email to best at bestup.net to place your order, and uh, all the sublimation blanks and uh, multicolor vinyls are also available. And if you have some questions about this machine, you can leave it on the comments below. And if you like this video and if you like Best of TV, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe our channel so we will get all the updates. And I'm Alex, hope to see you again in my next video.